How long have you worked in this one room? I set up the band in 1960 and moved here from right. Solo. Had very little to start with, and very few tools. Now, I know that um, you're, you're quite unashamed of the, of, the, of the state of this room. It's quite cluttered. You're, yeah. very, you're such a, a well-turned-out gentleman, and, that, <laughs> and yet you work in this... Well, it's a bit messy, isn't it? Yes, it is. But you don't mind that? Well, some visitors from the States rather like it. You know, that ah. they go back home and talk about the funny little old men. In a <laughs> Good. This, you're not using this as an excuse not to tidy, are you? You're saying you're doing it for the American market. <laughs> well, that's a good excuse. Many, many thousands of people know this book around the world. Um, it's one of our Bibles that we use, um, a great reference tool. And you don't dust, I presume? No, no, because they're so useful. Right. Yeah, Talk about Asian. Clapham dirt. Clapham dirt, I know you probably value above other kinds of dirt. Well, absolutely, because when I went to the States and looked for dirt, and sometimes I found a little here and there, but it was clean dirt. It didn't, wasn't effective. Where does the best dirt come from? Well, certainly Clapham and adjacent areas, we have dirty dirt here. <laughs> Here we are outside the British Museum. Bernard's promised to show us round. George Dillon from St. Gorski and Sackleaf worked here. Arthur Coons from St. Gorski was my mentor, worked here, and I was just about here. How do you feel now after seeing all that? Ambivalent. Why? Sad and happy. Um, yeah. Happy to see it again. Sad about all the ghosts, people who... Um, nearly everybody I've worked with is dead now. You have a, a cleaning lady now, but I presume she's forbidden from coming oh, down absolutely, here. absolutely, yes. Show me how you harvest dirt. Well, first of all, I have to put some Vaseline on the cotton wool to pick up the dirt. This looks like a good source. That's, uh, that's really grimy. Yes. I remember the story of your, the, the suitcase, what was that? When you wanted to age a book in a hurry. And you put it in a suitcase, did you not? No, I never did. You didn't? No. Oh, right. Oh, we'll have to edit that out. <laughs> <laughs>